Adobe Design to Print is a free plugin for Adobe Photoshop that makes it easy for you to take your artwork and create products for sale on Zazzle.com, where you can earn royalties for your creations, helping you turn your passion into a paycheck. With Adobe Design to Print, you can use all of the features available to you within Adobe Photoshop. One of the most important features is the Layers palette. And the Layers palette you can bring up if you don't have it already by going to the Window menu and selecting Layers. It's a dockable palette. You can put it wherever you like within your design. But the Layers palette is going to show you the different objects that you have available to you as part of your design. You can do all sorts of things on a layer. You can draw on a layer. Just select the layer, use the brush tool, and draw whatever it is you would like. At all times, the preview dialog is going to update to show you how your design has been affected by the changes that you've made to your layers. We can work with other types of layers. We can use images on a layer. We can place an image. You go to the file menu and say place embedded and pick an image that we might have on our hard drive or our system. We can place that image and I can scale the image by dragging the handles here. I'm going to drag it up from the top and I'm going to drag it down from the bottom to scale the image. And this allows me to bring in other artwork that I might have from other files. They could be images, they could be illustrations from another application like Adobe Illustrator. And we see within the layers palette that the order of the layers in the, in the stack here, as we call them, will influence what we see. So the image layer has come in above the layer where we drew our circle. So we see it on the top in our illustration here. If I were to grab this layer and drag it down beneath layer one, we'll see that the circle, the yellow circle that we drew, now appears above the image, and so that will be reflected on the preview. All the features of Adobe Photoshop are available to us. For example, we can use the text tool to create a text layer. I just draw a box. and place some text in it. And this too is available as a layer within our layers panel. We can use other features of Adobe Photoshop to create effects within our layers. So for example, I can select my layer one, which has my yellow circle. I can use the magic wand tool and actually select the space within the circle. If I then go to the layer with the image and click the quick mask tool to add a layer mask, then that will hide information of the image which is outside of the area that has been selected and I just see my waves now within my yellow circle. I can bring other layers in from my libraries so if I click on the libraries panel here I can actually drag in one of these illustrations into my layer tree as well. There are my shells that I've got as an image in my design. I can incorporate those. Now my shells have appeared above the image of the beach. Maybe I don't want them there. Maybe I'd like to have them at the bottom of my layer stack. That means I can put the waves from the beach above the shells in my design. And I can move any object around. All I need to do is use the move tool. I can select the text here and move that into the middle of my circle. So I'm building up a nice composite design here. Layers are a really powerful tool within Adobe Photoshop that allows you to create special effects between different objects. You can even merge the layers. You can use transparency effects. For example, I can click on my water here, change the opacity, and by reducing the opacity very slightly, allow the wave to be seen over the top of the shells. The shells are peeking through from underneath as I reduce the opacity of the waves in my design. I hope you found this video useful. If you've not done it already, you can download Design to Print at this link. There are more helpful links in the episode description below. And be sure to check out the other videos in the series.